When COVID-19 first hit UNCW in March of 2020, many didn't consider it a big deal. But when the decision was made to have students stay home for the semester after spring break, students realized that their college experience was in for a major change. After spending the rest of the spring semester at home, students returned in the fall to a campus drastically changed from the one they had left. The university had implemented mask mandates and social distancing policies, which affected classroom learning, residential life, and student interaction. Even with these protective mandates, however, many classes had to go fully online after COVID cases spiked across campus, leading to many students spending the entire semester in front of a computer or in a Zoom call. Now, while in-person classes have returned, vaccination rates have increased and UNCW's COVID infection rates have dropped, students like Connor DiGiacomo and Ethan Talley are still recovering from the disruption to their college experience that COVID brought about. Well, for me, it was mental health. I was, uh, I was in Galloway Hall, which didn't help from the beginning, in a very dingy area. Uh, and I was already starting to struggle a little bit with my classes, um, and then the quarantine stuff started. It hasn't been too bad. You know, I don't really like the masks in the dorms. It's getting kind of old. Ended up having to go back home and being isolated there for so long. Grade slipped, just couldn't handle it. Uh, I ended up actually getting kicked out of the college briefly, and then I appealed and then got back in. I feel like at a, a college full of like, young, healthy adults, we shouldn't really have to do that. Especially back at home, masks still aren't required. So. For COM 368 News, I'm Clovis Dufresne.